for Western Australia is seeking strong cooperation with India to boost more tourism into the region. Australia Minister for Transport and Tourism is on a visit to India and she had several high-level delegation talks with several stakeholders in India. DD India correspondent Dibendu Mondal spoke to Australian Minister of Transport and Tourism Rita Safiote to find out more. Listen in. I'm joined by the Minister for Tourism and Transport, Government of Western Australia. Uh, welcome to Doordarshan, ma'am. What type of cooperation are you looking at in, the ter in terms of tourism and transport uh, with the Indian stakeholders? Well, very keen to support more tourism into Western Australia. WA, Western Australia and India has a very close relationship, but I want to grow that relationship. So it's very much about seeing how, my, how we can work to get more Indian tourists into Western Australia. Also more tourism investment um, from the Indian business um, sector and also growing our international intake of um, Indian students. You uh, have also been talking about engagement with uh, various stakeholders, including the aviation sector as well as the uh, uh, hotel industry. Yeah. So have you had any talks with them and at what level of talks? Sir? Yes, we've been engaging to look at how we can get more um, or to actually have direct links between India and WA. There is such a strong Indian community in Western Australia and there's a strong call for those direct air links. Now the uh, meetings have been good and there's a strong economic case to have a direct air link between India and Western Australia. What does Western Australia offer to uh, the Indian tourists that will be flying there. It's a very unique experience and as I said you can do some really unique experiences. As I said visit Rottnest, um, meet quokkas, um, the happiest animal on earth. You can be swimming with wild sharks, you can be visiting our Swan Valley or Margaret River and experience incredible food and wine. There are a number of unique experiences. We have some of the best beaches in the world. Have you been able to engage with the uh, government stakeholders in India. We'll be meeting some government stakeholders tomorrow but very much looking at how we can continue to work with government and with the private sector to encourage a closer relationship between Western Australia and India. Well, thank you so much, ma'am, for speaking to Doordarshan, and we hope uh, your, uh, the Western Australian region becomes a popular tourist destination with Indians as well, and visiting more Indians into that region. Thank you so much for talking to Doordarshan. Thank you. Uh, this is Dibyendu Model with camera person Ankit from New Delhi for DD India.